Thanks for checking out our in-depth video on the Mesa Stowaway input buffer and the high wire dual buffer and boost pedal. Everything we connect between our guitars and our amplifiers has an effect on our tone. The best cabling and all the different pedals we like to use, even when bypassed and even true bypassed, it all leads to changes and often losses in your signal that affects the entire sound, right where it all starts. If you want tone and feel that makes the pedals on your board consistent and the signal to your amp just like it would be if you were using nothing but your guitar and a short cable, here's the solution. Buffering between your instrument, your pedal board, and your amp can be one of the most affordable and valuable additions to your rig for optimal tone and feel. It can also provide increased noise immunity from radio interference and reduce the switch pop found in many true bypass pedals. We'll get into some tone comparisons between buffered and unbuffered signal chains in a minute, but first let's talk a little bit about how and why a buffer works. The output from passive pickups is high impedance. High impedance signals are very sensitive to the capacitance of long cables and the input impedance of pedals. Most of us use a minimum of 30 to 40 feet of cable to connect all our gear, even in at-home playing situations. High frequency roll off and loss of attack and volume and punch starts to become audible with just about 20 feet of cable and just one or two pedals. So the more cabling and more pedals involved in your rig without buffering, the more loss you're likely to experience. Here's a comparison of 50 feet of cabling with and without a stowaway buffer as an example of the potential loss from cabling. hear the roll off in that example and with additional pedal board cabling, the switch contacts and the pedals and everything else involved in a basic pedal board build, 50 feet of cable is pretty standard these days. But the other key advantage to buffering that we can't hear but it's equally important is feel. The instrument pickup and amplifier relationship is reactive. This means that the pickups are actually affected by the way the amp's input receives the pickup signal. So when pickup output and amp impedances are matched, the exchange of signal information is optimized. While the capacitance of cables that causes high end loss also affects this loading, the primary killer of ideal pickup loading is pedals. Some pedals, even true bypass pedals, load the pickups undesirably, so the first connection from your guitar's output is crucial. Placing a stowaway or a high wire in front of your first pedal provides your pickups with the consistent loading and the impedance match they want, while the buffering converts the signal to low impedance and this makes the signal throughout the pedal board no longer susceptible to the pedal variations. The bottom line, load your pickups correctly and the connection between your hands, your instrument and your tone is enhanced and elevated. While the high wire utilizes the exact buffer circuitry and noise immunity of the stowaway, it also offers transparent foot switchable end of pedal chain clean boost, think awesome solo control or a front end tube driver. The foot switchable boost offers up to 22 dB of adjustability right before your amp's input. Add in the buffered tuner output and foot switchable mute the selectable plus 3 dB output line driver that compensates for any losses from the pedal board drive to your amp and this is just about the absolute top shelf of buffering available. And the right side input and output make the high wire ideal for right side pedal board placement an easy breakdown of your pedal board's input and output cables at the end of the night. So here's a final quick example of our sample pedal board with a variety of commonly used pedals and the 50 feet of cable we've been using. And we'll switch the high wire in and out of the circuit so you can hear the difference.
So that wraps up the stowaway and high wire in-depth buffer video. Buffers prevent the loss in tone and feel that you might not even know you were missing. Based on many years of R&D and designed with the finest components available and built in Petaluma, California, USA, we look forward to helping you reclaim your tone with what we believe are the best buffer products available today. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us via phone, email, or message us via social media, and we'll be happy to help you with any inquiries you may have. Thanks for your interest in Mesa products, thanks for your support, and thanks for watching. Thank mm -hmm. you.